What are we doing in the basement, Howie? Well, I was down here poking around looking for my tongue scrubber and... What? Why would you need a tongue scrubber? I see your point. Anyway, so I moved this big crate and suddenly... Ta-da! <gasps> my self-portrait of me painting a self-portrait! Oh, I've been looking everywhere for that. Not that. <laughs> this! A door I've never seen before! You dragged me down here to show me a door? Yep. And I thought who better to open it with than my best bud. Oh, thanks, pal. Plus, there might be like a monster or something in there, so I figured you could go first. Yeah! Ah! Wow! Wow, look at all the cool old stuff, or wow, look at the size of that monster! The first one. Wow. I bet no one's been in here for years. Look at this old trunk. It's probably filled with all sorts of amazing old stuff. And check out this antique sandwich I found! That's nice, uh, Howie. Oh. Meh, kind of stale. Oh. A Derek Danger action doll! Still in the box! It's in mint condition, too! And look, he even talks! I like milk. Milk is fine. Huh? That doesn't sound like Dirk Danger at all. I feel a nap coming on. Why does he sound so boring? I don't know, but now that he mentions it, <sighs> a nap sounds like a pretty good idea. No time for naps, my slumbersome senorita. I know someone who will be happy to tell us why this doll is so weird. <sighs> so, what brings you two buffoons here? We're here to see what you know about Dirk Danger collectibles. Oh, you know, not much. I just happen to be a Dirk Danger collectibles expert. Behold my glorious collection! <sighs> the Dirk Danger Perilous Pasta Maker. The Dirk Danger Load and Explode Doorbell. This Denta Danger Mint Toothpaste. Never been used! What can you tell us about this? Be sure to floss, but carefully. Ah! Do you have any idea what this is? It's a Dirk Danger doll. I thought he said he was an expert. Not just any Dirk Danger doll. This one is super special. But why does he sound so boring? Due to a mix-up at the factory, some of the dolls were accidentally given the voice of Cautious Carl. Cautious Carl? I've never heard of him. Yeah, well, you know, he wasn't around for very long. Is everyone ready to sit down and be very still so nobody gets hurt? <laughs> the dolls were quite unpopular and soon vanished from existence forever! All but this one, it seems. The only one left in the world. And, and it's, it's ours! Mine! What? Right, ours! Why don't you, um, sell me the doll, hmm? Are, Are you, you kidding? kidding? I just have your best interest at heart. You know, sharing something this valuable can be very hard on a friendship. Pshaw. Octo and me? Fighting over something as silly as a doll? Huh, preposterous. Well, we'll be leaving now. Toodaloo! No friendship can withstand the allure of the Dirk doll. It will surely be mine. Oh, yes! They'll be back! <laughs> um, we haven't even gotten out the door yet. Sorry, I, I got a little ahead of myself there. All right, Priceless Dirk, let's get you out of that box. Yeah. Chloe, no! It's in perfect condition! Hmm, I'll tell you what, old pal. On the count of three, we'll both say what we want to do with the doll. Agreed? Agreed. All right, then. One, two, three. Keep Put him in, in the, the toilet! What? Why would you do that? Mm -hmm. Oh, I know. We'll have some kind of contest, and the winner decides what to do with it. A contest? Woo, I'm in. But nothing involving licorice or nostrils. Really? Because I think I totally had a chance with that one. Oh, well. Ooh. What? Okay, rock, paper, scissors to determine the official owner of some dumb doll. Ready? One, two, three. Rock! Oh. oh. One, two, three. Rock! Oh. oh. One, two, three. Rock! Oh. One, two, three. Rock! Oh. oh. Mm. 
One, two, three, rock! Ah, this isn't working. What if we just shared the doll? You mean like I get it six days a week and you get it uh, the other days? No, I'm thinking of something a little fairer. Sure. Oh, and when it's my turn, can I? No, you cannot stuff licorice in its nose. It's scary how well you know me sometimes. since you two are incapable of sharing a dumb doll. Bunny, can you tell Howie that it's all his fault? Hmm. Narwhal, could you tell Bunny to tell Duck to tell... Wait, who's all here again? Right, to tell Octo that I'm not speaking to him. Duck, could you tell Bunny to tell Narwhal to tell Howie that I'm not going to dignify that with a response? In fact, you can tell him I want my best friend Undies back. <sighs> Very well. Narwhal, if you would. Ew. The tension is palpable. This will never work. Uh, I agree. This doll is causing too much trouble. You're right. What have we become? I mean, just look at us. I'd rather not. I'm sorry, buddy. Let's never have a doll come between us again, no matter how boring and rare it is. Maybe we should just sell it to Hippo. That's a great idea. I should handle the sale of your doll. But before I take the gig, we need to agree on my fee. We can give you this deck of playing cards with three of the queens missing. Done. See what I did there? I took your offer before you had time to reconsider. That's master negotiating. Nice. I'm willing to give you... Deal. Oh, wait. Shouldn't we see what his offer is first? Fine, but make it quick. I'm late for my tennis game, and my opponent does not like to be kept waiting. Why does my banjo have so many strings? I'm willing to give you this first edition Girk Danger coloring book with combustible crayons. Ooh! Take it. What else have you got? How about this Dirk Danger replica mini bazooka wristband? Whoa! How can you say no, fellas? That was awfully impressive. But surely you can do better than that. You forced me to bring out my most prized possession. A Dirk Danger three-haired mole! Wow! Three hairs! We could own an actual growth from our favorite stunter ever! Excellent! One strange little doll for a hairy chunk of somebody's flesh. You got a deal. You like this? <laughs> uh, Dirk Danger! Finally! Last not speaking right, Dirk Doll is found. Do you mean to say that you've been looking for one of these boring dolls? But why? They are super rare and it would be meaning very much to be having one in my collection. Stop! You can't seriously be considering just giving it away, even if it is to Dirk Danger himself. It's all yours, Mr. Danger. Ah! Everyone. Yeah! He put him in the toilet! Mr. Danger, sir, why did you do that? Dark owes it to fans not to allow boring merchandise to be existing, no matter how priceless it is. So, to say thank you, please accept this! The prototype for the new remote control Dirkatron 5000! You're not I hope you don't mind sharing. Not at all. You see, Howie and I have learned that no toy is better than a best- Gimme, 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 gimme! 
Circuitron to the toilet. Plunger? And maybe some bandages? Yep, it's great to have my best friend back. On my way, pal! <laughs>